How's it going guys? Um, in this video, I'm, we're going to talk about what is the best OS for your PCNet business. So, I think the straight answer is just use Windows. So, but which Windows? So, Windows 10, Windows 7, but I just recently discovered that most Windows 7s are not created equal. So, some say Windows 10, but it's loaded with bloatware. So, um, so Windows 10 is out of the question. So what I what I recommend is you you have to use like a custom uh, Windows 7. So all the bloatware from the regular Windows are taken out. So the, you have only the bare minimums. So behind me are two computers which I experimented with. Uh, this one runs Windows 7 Blue Light, I think. Wait. Uh, window, this one runs Windows 7 Aero Blue Light, while this one, that one, this computer, uh, this one runs on Windows 7 Lite Edition. Yeah, um, yeah. So both of these, they only, uh, they only have, they only occupy one uh, one gig of space. So the regular Windows 7, they, I think they occupy around three gigs, three or four gigs on the. Um, on the flash drive so uh, when I install this it really it's really fast so uh, it only was around 30 minutes uh, 15 minutes 15 minutes to take them to install the OS and then I install the games and the drivers and everything so uh, I highly recommend that if you're planning to put up your own piece of net business and you're and you can't decide on what OS so I highly recommend that you search. I can't provide the link, guys, because somehow YouTube algorithm they uh, they some they don't like uh, promoting pirated piracy links. So this one is just search. I'll have I'll have it link. I'll have I'll have the complete name of this program. You can just search it on Google, and then you can download. It's free. Uh, win this is Windows 7 Aero Blue Light. It's really fast. It's good for gaming. It, it can really add. Uh, it can reduce the boot time to like below one minute I think yeah it's around 30 seconds you can just from boot to desktop it's really fast even if you're on a hard drive if it's on SSD it's really blazing fast same here with the Windows 7 Lite edition all of the bloatware from the window regular Windows 7 has been taken out um, you can you can play games uh, everything but the downside is what I what I notice is that when I try to install a win uh, printer driver because I install it on my friend's computer and then when I try to plug in the printer and then I try to install the printer's driver it gave me an error that there are missing files so if you're not using any printer or anything or any of the stuff uh, you can use this so basically these computers they are only used for web browsing gaming mostly esports games like League of Legends and Dota 2 and other stuff so it's so it's a really good fit for this type of scenario so uh, the benefit is that it reduces boot, uh, boot time to just 30 seconds from from the start to the desktop and also it doesn't occupy a large space on your hard drive so you have a lot of space for your games and other stuff and also uh, they somehow affect games like the time the bo games boot up it's really it, it really uh, adds the frame rate. Also, it adds to the frame rate. I compared the regular Windows and uh, uh, this light edition of Windows 7. So there's a really a different, there's a really big difference between boot time and then game performance. So guys, if you're planning to put up your PCNet business, I highly recommend just search this either Windows 7 Lite or Windows 7 Aero Blue Lite. So thank you for watching the video and I'll see you on the next one. Peace. Shh. <laughs>